question. What does it take to be a man in this crazy land upon which we stand? Does it take someone that's good with his hands, ready to bite and swing and do other things to cope with the stress that everyday life brings, while in pursuit of that elusive brass ring? That's just out of reach. Well, that's what some teach. While others preach the tyranny of the cheek, but is that what is needed to forget that you're bleeding as a result of the cold vicious beating that the world has delivered to you on the plate, leaving your mind in a terrible state? A look that says, leave me alone, don't you know I am prone to go off on you because you cut off my phone again? <laughs> when will it end? Is the solution around the next bit? Heart filled with pain, bad thoughts on the brain, thinking this life will drive you insane? Well, allow me to explain. See, being a man is nothing to fear, nor is it something that should bring you tears. After all, many men have been so for years. But in order to get that job done, fathers need to teach their sons not just show up on the weekend to have fun or be around to buy the latest Tommy Hill figure or address each other using the word nigga. Their involvement and guidance needs to be bigger. Then to be able to see the true picture is about stepping up to your responsibilities and treating your women just like a true queen and keeping your mind, body, and soul clean and stop smoking the blunts and drinking no weed. So as I put this to bed, keep this thought in your head, because this is just something that needs to be said. Being a man in this crazy land in which we stand is achievable when you realize the power is in your hands. Hey. Cool. Now.